Okay, good. Uh, today we're still testing Minimax, and specifically, we're testing Minimax's agent. First, let's randomly pick a report about AIGC. As you can see, this report is basically all in Chinese. Then, we'll have Minimax's agent read the report and generate an English PPT in a cyberpunk style. And as you can see, it generates it very quickly. Now let's take a look at this PPT. It's entirely in English, the layout is quite good, and it even has a cyberpunk flickering effect. Next, let's have it help us create a tarot card fortune telling website. Again, it generates it very quickly. I think this website was generated really well. And here, you can see there's also a page for entering personal subscription information. Once you successfully subscribe, it will send you an email. Next, let's have it make a game. First, I give it an instruction. Help me create a romantic interactive text game. And as you can see, regardless of how the game's interactions work, at least the overall page style is absolutely fine in my opinion. Then I ask the agent to help me make a stickman fighting game. Okay, finish that very quickly as well. And uh, on the homepage here, it even shows the control keys for two players. Uh, and you can see that the players in the game can walk around, perform simple movements and attacks, and there are even some jumping features. Although the game is a bit rough after all, it's a game generated from just a single sentence. Okay, that's the end of today's testing. I actually think everyone can start using these tools, because if you get a task and uh, your first thought is still to do it yourself, I think your efficiency might be quite low and the results may not even be that good. Okay, today's testing is over. Goodbye.